Hello, I'm Colin Bolton and this is uh, Adept Knowledge Management Offices in Aberdeen. I'm glad I got a chance to talk to you. I want to talk to you about an applied project management course. It's a workshop uh, using all the knowledge you would have gained on our PMI course, our PMI Project Management Certificate course, and applying that to a real oil field development. It's about five days long and we cover the full range of project management topics and disciplines in a major case study. And the case study is really exploiting an oil field. So we go through the capital value process, four of the five stages. Obviously we can't do the execution bit, but we do appraise, select, and define uh, in preparation for execution and then eventually to operate. And we thread all the PMI knowledge areas and process groups through all of that capital value process. The timetable of five days is split up into the first day deals with defining the scope, work breakdown structure, preparing to estimate, and looking at how the estimate will eventually integrate into the plan. And we deal with that mainly on Tuesday, the second day. So we deal with planning, integrated with estimating, and looking and checking at the scope, scope management, looking at all that, and trying to avoid making too many changes. And we cross the Rubicon into that area of integrated project management plan and budget. And we're set up then to do both qualitative and quantitative risk analysis on the third day, which is the Wednesday. By the time we've gone through to do that, uh, looking at all aspects of risk analysis, where we can look at P50s and P90s, and people will understand that terminology, being able to assess contingency, as well as being able to more or less estimate or calculate contingency. We move on to the fourth day, Thursday, where we're looking at some part of the execution. And we simulate parts of the project being executed and applying some project control and monitoring and reporting techniques in there. The earned value analysis, forecasting, and risk-based earned value analysis. That takes us through a lot of diagnostics on projects, finding out what went right, what went wrong, managing the potential for change, managing stakeholders, etc., and also managing the team, the project team. By the time we get to the fifth day, Friday, we're looking at presenting the results, as well as some sessions on project reviews. That includes peer reviews, that includes integrated baseline reviews, and generally establishing things that have gone wrong in a project in order to put them right before they get too damaging. I hope that sounds interesting to you. The people who've done this course already have done it in, um, in Scotland, in Aberdeen, and in the Northeast. We've done it in Paris, and we've done it in Po, and we've done it in the Middle East. And there are people just about to do it in South America. So we hope uh, that you might like it, and you might like to look at the description of this course on our website, adeptknowledgemanagement.com. So that's adept-knowledge.com. You can click on the link that you see next to this video. Um, we do suggest to people that it'd be better off if they've already done the PMI certificate, or if they've got four or five, possibly better to have seven years experience in project management. And if you're any, in any doubt about that, you can always look at our website and have a go at our project management assessment test. Uh, we let people do that free in order to find out how good they are. Uh, it's part of our competence management uh, system and I'm going to talk to you about that perhaps on another video. But I hope this has been useful for you to understand a little bit about the applied project management course in oil and gas. Down the line we'll talk about an applied project management course in drilling, an applied project management course in field development for the different strands of knowledge in oil field. So, thanks for your attention and look forward to seeing you. Cheerio.